Hi, this is Raya with your weekly weather roundup for July 28th to August 3rd. Tropical storm Bertha developed east of the Bahamas on Friday and made its way northwest toward the U.S. But the center is unlikely to hit land as the storm is giving the country a wide berth. Uh, as of this Monday, Bertha has become the second hurricane of the 2014 Atlantic season. Early this week, the east saw severe activity as an EF2 tornado hit Chelsea and Revere, Massachusetts Monday morning with estimated maximum wind speeds at 120 miles per hour. The state has seen only 162 tornadoes since 1950, and the affected county never reported a tornado until this week. Ah, pissa, how you like them apples? Folks were wicked surprised. Uh, chowder? More fires in the west, including 14 on the border between California and Oregon, burning more than 183 square miles of land. Along with two more fires in Latin National Forest, the fires have prompted California Governor Jerry Brown to declare a state of emergency. Washington state is also battling wildfires, including the Carlton Complex fire, which has burned over 250,000 acres so far. Sunday, major flooding in the southwest from torrential rainfall associated with monsoonal moisture. 3.89 inches recorded in Mount Baldy, California, and 0.81 inches in Palm Springs, a first for the city, with measurable rainfall on the third day of August. Lake Havasu City, Arizona was hit hard and damaging winds affected the Phoenix area. Guys, I've got some news. I will be taking a hiatus. Well, because I'm, what? Oh, I can't tell them. Okay. Um, well, all I'll say is baby. I mean, bye-bye. <laughs>